Hi guys, it's Shelly here and um, things are just really starting to happen here. It's so exciting. Um, we picked up our, st our range, our oven, the other day and it's um, been in the back of the pickup for a couple of days. So we need to get it out of there. So we are going to unbox our, our oven and stick it in the bus today. Um, yeah, it's a little bit premature, but you got to do what you got to do when things happen. So that's what we're going to do today. Here comes Randy with the heister. Uh, didn't know it had a horn, did you? Ah, I did it! <laughs> and the stove is inside there. So we're going to use the heister to get her out of there. Um, since it's just Randy and I here. So I just want to share the thing that we loved was that it says right here, off a grid appliance. Yes. We are going off grid, baby. I'm like, ooh. Rule number one is get it back down low to the ground. Rule number one is get it back down low to the ground. So we're going to take it to the back door or the front door? I think we're going to have to go in the front door, but until we unwrap it, I don't know, so... Okay. I say we go over here in the sunshine. Okay. Stand it up and unwrap it and see which door it is. I think it'll fit through either door, but the box will not fit. The box the won't fit through the door. So we got to get her unwrapped. Oh, hi, baby. Oh, I'm so excited. Start unwrapping it. You take the grates out of that styrofoam thing. I think. Ooh, they're heavy. Oh, and they're just. Oh, and it's just a double. So you can leave them in the bubble. Yeah. Then. I can put them inside the bus, yeah. right? Hardware for Randy. <laughs> this is so exciting. Hey, people! I have to tell you, building a bus is better than Christmas, man. You get all these packages and it's it's just like oh hey, watch out something can fall out yeah, of this engine. It's gonna this, this is this thing. No, there's like all kinds of little stuff in here. Oh yeah, that's the burners. Okay. So I'm gonna take it take in there this in one inside piece. in one piece. Oh, I think I think we're down to the main body now, huh? Well, that's looking like I think it'll fit through the back door. That's the easy way in. Yeah, this way we would have to go up and turn, huh? Right. This door is wider. Huh? The front door is wider, but pull the plastic out. Let's see what it looks like. The great unveil! Woo! Here's the front. Wow! Check her out! Oh, she's beautiful! Oh, that's a unique stove. <laughs> Did you know it was a unique brand? No, I didn't. Huh. How funny is that? Oh, it has a little drawer down there. Yeah. Like we should know no. these things since we ordered it. But... I think that was, that's where the, uh, I think the broiler oven maybe? There was something about that that was special. I think you're right. That's yeah. an oven, oven, and that's and I, where you, oh, oh, because it's a gas range. Yeah. You broil. We'll see if it opens. It doesn't because it's, it's sitting inside this. No, it's above that. There you go. Yeah, broiler oven. It's the broiler. Yeah, we did know that. We do actually oh. know what we ordered. <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> <laughs> we just ordered it a while back. Oh, she's beautiful. And I love, I love that it's a small, compact one. It's, it's all we need in the bus. We don't need a great big oven. So which door is it going to fit through? The back door or the front door? Either one. It's easy. It's only, this is only 20 inches. Ah, sweet. And the back door is 23. It's the refrigerator that was a tighter fit. Yeah. I remember that now. Yeah. So this will go in through either door. We just need some manpower to help us get it in there. 
because I don't think your bustles are going to cut it. You don't think my bustles are big enough? We had our furniture cart. One of those many possessions that we chose to not possess. Yeah, anymore. that we felt we didn't need, huh? <laughs> we could just wheel it in there. Well, you were fixing to bust your bustles. I know. I don't have to. Use your female charm. You need some help. Hey, Chris. <laughs> Is there's two of us. Crazy Chris, can you help Randy pack that in? Nah. Please. Go, we go down your way. Oh, you need to look. She can do easy, easy walk right in. That's pretty hilarious. It's gonna be good. We, yeah, we were just, we were just saying. It's hilarious. We were just like, he's like, can you lift it? And I'm like, I think so. And he's like, well, help will arrive if we need it. And you guys, I'm here like, go. here comes help. We have help. But two Chris's. And cash. Yes, and cash. Of course, cash. You just bolt it down, though. I don't know. Awesome. So with the help of Chris, um, Randy and him got it inside the bus, so now we're just kind of checking her out. Yeah, the battery pack is right down here. Yeah. And this oh. thing is really cool. It's magnetic. They got two little magnets on here, so that just oh, picks on with cool. the magnet. You can just take that off, change your batteries. There's your broiler. It has two, two, two rack levels. So you can still have toast, baby. I know, I'm loving it. Propane toast. And um, she's a little bit deeper. deeper than we had anticipated, but she's still gonna fit. Um, our, she's gonna not stick past the wall, so. Um, well, let's just see. It's, it's all going to be good. 30 inches. Here comes. It's a fit. <laughs> oh, the bus angels were with us on that one, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody's looking out for you. Uh, I'll save that uh, the flat on that cardboard, and, but you could throw all the styrofoam in the dumpster. Oh. There's a screw. Uh-oh. Well, that had to come out of somewhere. Uh-oh. She's got a screw loose. That's <laughs> right. We'll find where that goes. <laughs> okay. I'm going to haul this all to the dumpster. So we have our oven in her designated spot. And she looks so great right there. So, um, she just, it's, she's so cute. It's just, a, it's really, really cool. But um, we gotta do a little bit more research on hooking up the propane and how we want to plumb the propane because we have the fireplace on this side which takes propane also. So Randy's gonna do a little bit of research on that and then we will get her hooked up and start using her. But um, her location seems to work pretty good. We actually, she's a little bit, you can see by my tape on the floor, she sticks out a little bit more than what I had anticipated, about two inches, but we still clear the wall. And we probably have her out from the wall just a little bit further than it's gonna require. But we're still going to clear the wall that's right there, and it's gonna be perfect. So we just want to thank you guys for sharing this journey with us. Um, we enjoy sharing it with all of you. And we will just catch you in the next one. Love to all of you. Bye.